my name is Sloan and welcome to this week's Fit and 15 Abs and Core. You're going to need a mat today. Grab your timers and set them for one minute. Let's get started. All right, so fingertips are going to be facing your heels. Your butt is going to be down instead of out, so drop it down to the mat. You're going to grab one foot, lay down. The foot that you just went and grabbed, you're going to lift that same knee up to the chest and then pull everything back up. Grab the other toe, lay down, and then bring that knee in. So the leg that you kick is the knee that you're going to bring to the chest. Good. That's it. So one minute here. Good. Keep your chest open. We've got a lot of bird visitors right now, it seems like, <laughs> flying over our heads. <laughs> so keep that chest open. Good work. Lay completely flat. Don't cheat yourself there. Last one. Good. All right. This time we're going to flip it over. I'm going to give you a fun little tip for this one that you can try at home. So if you have a towel or two paper plates, go and get them. I'm going to tell you what you're going to do with them. Um, I can't do it. I'm on concrete. But if you have hardwood floors or even carpet would work with the paper plates, it's fun. Trust me. All right. So you're going to start in a plank, shoulders over your wrist. You're going to give me two reptile knees. Okay, so if you had the towel or the plates, you're going to put them under your toes. So after you do those two reptile knees, you would just drag your knees in, okay, while you're on the plate or the towel. Reach up, squeeze, and then when you push out, you're pushing out. Push out those plates, push out the towel. I've tried it, it really does work, okay? So two knees, and if you're like, no way, don't want to, you don't have to. You'd be surprised how much it adds. So if you want to modify this, instead of taking your knees, is that already a minute? There's a lot of talking. Okay, so modification real quick. You can pull those knees into the center. And when you come up to your knees, don't just be complacent. Really squeeze, reach, lean back a little bit. That's a good one. All right, third and final drill. This is a good one too. So your legs are straight. Again, those arms, they're in a V over the head. So you're gonna exhale your breath, sit up, and when you're up, click your heels together, open your feet up, lay back down. So you're stopping wherever you can keep a nice flat back. So look, if that doesn't work for you, you can crunch, bring your feet in, open, crunch, whatever works. You can figure out a modification that works for you. I'm just giving you the idea. And you can take it from there. Good work. So make sure you're looking up, exhaling your breath when you lift, squeeze all those muscles when you bring those feet together. It's great work on the quads. Obviously great work for the abs. Good job, you guys. Keep it up. Two more here. Good. Last one. Great job. You've got four sets left. Thanks for joining me.